brothers and sisters, in our gospel today, it's so clear that our Lord Jesus Christ has been consistently trying to correct a kind of mentality of people in his time. And here, it's all about um, holiness. The holiness of the scribes and the Pharisees in which their holiness is not actually encompassing, but it is div divisive. And here, there is a kind of mentality that they are so self-righteous that they look down to the sinners, to the erring, to the wicked. And Jesus would like to define the, the holiness. He supposedly... Uh, this is encompassing. That is why Jesus made use of the parable of the lost coin, made use the parable of the lost ship to, to bring the very message that mercy is upon for everyone, especially to the sinners, to the wicked, to the array. We have this uh, tendency to be self-righteous when we look down to the sinners in which they don't have the room to change and to improve. But so clear that in our gospel today, our Lord Jesus Christ inviting us to see that the mercy of God is for everyone, especially to the sinners, especially to the wicked, especially to the erring people. My dear brothers and sisters, here we see that this bare statement of the scribes and Pharisees when they said, this man welcomes sinners and eats with them. But Jesus said, what man among you having had with sheep Losing one of them would not leave the 99 in the desert and go after the lost one until he finds it. And, or what woman having 10 coins and losing one would not light a lamp and sweep the house, searching carefully until she finds it. We see here that our Lord Jesus Christ looks at the very heart of each one which is there uh, resides the, the authenticity and truthfulness and genuineness to seek God. Jesus Christ said, I desire mercy, not sacrifice, in which God looks at the heart of the person, the genuineness of his desire to seek God. And these Pharisees and scribes defined their holiness, defined their holiness, something that is uh, far from their heart, something that is only more on conformity, something that is more on legalism. But at the end, at the end of the day, what really matters is that our heart was truly, humbly, genuinely seeking for God. God is a God of mercy and compassion. God desires for the salvation of everyone, most especially for the sinner, for the wicked, for the lost ones. Amen. Please stand.